Welcome to Sex Positive Gaming. I'm Annie and today I want to talk about the 2019 visual novel, Twists of My Life. This is a completed slice of life college romance available for PC, Mac, and Android on Steam, Itch.io, and their Patreon. In Twists of My Life, you play as a male law student who has just transferred to a new university. There are seven different romanceable main female characters with some optional side relationships. This is a choose-your-own-adventure style visual novel, so all of your decisions will funnel you into one of the 17 different endings. Yes, there is an ending with two of the women, but this is not a harem game. Graphically, this title is a little dated. The Daz renders are not as good looking as more recent visual novels. They're not bad, but Twists of My Life looks a lot more like an older game like Man of the House than it does a newer game like Being a Dick. There are some short animations in the sexual interactions that loop. Unfortunately, the game is completely silent. No music, no ambient noise, no sounds at all. While this is primarily a male heterosexual experience, your flavors will actually be heavily influenced by the women you choose to pursue and your final ending. Different characters focus specifically on different flavors. This includes group, sharing, lesbian, exhibitionism, cheating, pregnancy, power exchange, and some violence. So one of these days, I'm going to play a game from a Russian developer where the story isn't bleak. That day is not today. The main character is rude and unlikable, and most of the female characters are two-dimensional archetypes. I mean, I'm looking for escape here. If I wanted horrible and fake people, I could just go on Instagram. I do like that all of your actions have consequences. The only problem is that some paths and consequences make absolutely no sense. You will definitely need a walkthrough for the latter half of the game, but the first 12 days have almost no choices. I mean, this isn't a bad game, but it does show how much improvement there has been in the quality of content in newer titles over the last few years. We have become spoiled by the recent wave of better rendered, more immersive stories that have great audio and soundtracks. All of these features actually seem to be in the developer, novel's, new game, Void's Calling. Maybe our expectations are just… higher now. So if you enjoy choose your own adventure style visual novels and are looking for a more realistic romantic experience as opposed to a harem power fantasy, and if you don't mind older style Daz renders, you can have a great time playing Twists of My Life. Let me know what you think. How much better have the games in our industry become over the past few years? What older games do you feel have aged the best and are still awesome? Will I ever get a whimsical game full of sunshine and rainbows from a Russian developer? And as always, no shaming, just gaming. Thanks to all this month's supporters on Patreon. I wouldn't have been able to do this without you.